ओम नमो ब्रह्मादिभ्यो ब्रह्म विद्या संप्रदाय कर्तृभ्यो सर्वोपलित प्रज्ञान घन प्रत्यगर्थ ब्रह्म नारायण पद्म वशिष्ठ शक्ति तत्पुत्र पराशर व्यासम शुकं गौड़ पद महांत गोविंद योगींद्र मथा से शिष्य श्रीशंकराचार्य मथा से पद्म पाद हस्तामल पंच शिष्य दंतोटक ूर्त ोचर विचिम प्रभाव संसार धीजनित दुखम भूजन से ब्रह्मधीजनित सौख्यम भूच तुक्मिणी सहित हम नमा यमिह कारुणिक शरण गोप्यरी सहोदरापमहत्पम तमाशु हरि परमाश्री जनक सुखाकृति so <clears throat> in the teka purnanandya we saw shastrasya adhyay chatushtyatmakatvena adhyaya bhedakam tadavantara prameyam ah adhyanam iti so how the adhyayas are divided we saw mula meaning ratna prabha in the vyakhya what was said is um, is moved over the page okay so what was said is that the uh, adhyayas which are discussed there are what in, in uh, brahma sutras what is the content of each chapter adhyayas those are what Sam- samanvaya avirodha sadhana and phala सो समन्वय समन्वयाध साधन फला अध्याय सो अध्यान दि प्रमेय इज मेन देर एस टू वॉट इज ए विषय प्रमेय मीन विषय वॉट इज ए विषय समन्वय फर्स्ट चैप्टर विषय इज समन्वय सेकेंड अविरोध थर्ड साधन एंड फोर्थ फला टीका सो फला पूर्वेण फला पूर्व प्रमेय अन्वय सो दिस पद इन दि व्याख्या विल कनेक्ट विद दि अर्यर प्रमेय विच वॉज मेन अर्यर एज प्रमेय देर बाय देर बाय देर वुड बी अन्वय एज टू ईच चैप्टर सो दैट इज एक्सप्लेन फर्दर इन दि टीका एज टू या फला पूर्व प्रमेय अन्वय प्रथम अध्याय से समन्वय प्रमेय द्वितीय अध्याय से अविरोध प्रमेय वाक्य योजना सो ऑन वॉट इज दब्जेक्ट मैटर वॉट इज प्रमेय तथा अध्याय समन्वयादिक प्रतिपाद्य भाव सो प्रमेय इज विषय देर बाय अध्याय थ्रू दि चैप्टर्स ऑफ दि ब्रह्म सूत्र समन्वयादिक समन्वय अविरोध एक्सेट्रा प्रतिपाद्य इट इज रिवील्ड एनलाइजिंग दि श्रुति वाक्या श्रुति मंत्री भाव दट इज ऐडिया अध्याय से पाद चतुष्टयात्मक पादेदक प्रमेय आह हव एवर वी आर लुकिंग इन टू दि फर्स्ट चैप्टर इन दैट दि फर्स्ट चैप्टर देर आर फोर पादास वॉट अबउट दम आर ऑल दि पादास talking about the same thing or there is a bheda between padas in the first chapter and second chapter also but context is first chapter right now therefore what is the division in the padas based upon aha tatra iti so vyakhya says 
तत्र प्रथम पाद से स्पष्ट ब्रह्म लिंगा समन्वय प्रमेय द्वितीय तृतीय अस्पष्ट ब्रह्म लिंगा चतुर्थ पाद से पदमात्र समन्वय की भेद सो वॉट इज द डिफरेन्स देर दि फस्ट पाद इन दि फस्ट चैप्टर डील्स विथ मंत्र वेर दि ब्रह्म विच इज डिस्कस देर इज स्पष्ट इट इज अद्वैत दि विषय अद्वितीय ब्रह्म एकम अद्वितीय ब्रह्म इज वेरी क्लियर सो स्पष्ट ब्रह्म दि मंत्र आर ग्रुप्ड इन सच मैनर इन दि फस्ट पाद टू बी एनलाइज दैट दे क्लियरली शो दि तात्पर्य विषय ऑफ अद्वैत वेदांत विच इज एकम आदित्य ब्रह्म एंड ऐक्य इज दि विषय देर सो देर फोर दोज आर दि कंटेट ऑफ दि प्रथम पाद ऑफ दि प्रथम अध्याय वॉट अबाउट दि सेकेंड एंड थर्ड देर इज ए लिटिल डिफरेंस बिटवीन सेकेंड एंड थर्ड बट पुट टुगेदर यू कैन सी दैट वेर दि मंत्र डू नॉट क्लियरली शो दि एकता और दि ब्रह्म निर्गुण ब्रह्म दोज कैंड ऑफ मंत्र आर एनलाइज एंड तात्पर्य विषय is shown to be the same so those mantras are dealt with therefore the second and the third padas have the vishaya as aspashta brahma linga naam aspashta brahma linga na prameyam samanvaya samanvaya prameyam so samanvaya is the topic broad topic in the first chapter so samanvaya of what so samanvaya of the spashta brahma linga vakyas in the फर्स्ट पाद इन दि सेकेंड एंड थर्ड पाद समन्वय ऑफ दि अस्पष्ट ब्रह्मलिंग वाक्या एंड चतुर्थ पाद से पदमात्र समन्वय की भेद वेरा चतुर्थ पाद लुक्स एट दि फोर्थ पाद ऑफ दि फर्स्ट चैप्टर लुक्स एट दि दि वर्ड्स दम सेल्स इन दि मंत्र एंड एनलाइज इज दि वर्ड्स पदमात्र समन्वय एंड देन शोज दट तात्पर्य विषय स्टील ऐक्य अकरण से प्राथम्या न अकरण संगतिरपेक्षिता बिकॉज दिस इज दि फस्ट चैप्टर एंड इन दि फस्ट चैप्टर द फस्ट अधिकरण इज बिगन देर फोर द अधिकरण विल नॉट हैव अ संगति बींग दि फस्ट अधिकरण सो वॉट इज अधिकरण विल सी इट विल कम अप इन दि इट वी हेव सीन दैस टू संशय संशय विषय विषय विशेष एक्सेट्रा सो देर आर फाइव थिंग्स विच आर लुक दैट इन इन अ सेक्शन If those five things are the same across sutras, then those bunch of sutras will make one adhikarana. Their sangati is one of them. That sangati cannot be talked about because this is the first adhikarana. Tika prathama dhyaye ityat irtharta ha. So what has been said is tatra prathama padasya the prathama dhyaye prathama padasya ityartha. प्रमेय विषय वॉट इज प्रमेय सब्जेक्ट मैटर विषय द्वितीय तृतीय पाद प्राण जनरली वॉट इज द डिफरेंस देर द्वितीय तृतीय पाद प्राण सविशेष निर्विशेष ब्रह्म प्रतिपादक परस्पर भेद इत प्रमेय निरूपयति द्वितीय सो इन दि सेकेंड चैप्टर फर्स्ट चैप्टर सेकेंड एंड थर्ड पाद जनरली सविशेष एंड निर्विशेष ब्रह्म सो सगुण निर्गुण बोथ आर डिस्कस देर देर इज अ मिक्सअप एंड इफ देर इज अ मिक्सअप देन वन के नॉट क्लियरली नो देर बाय परस्परम ब्रह्म प्रतिपादक परस्परम सविशेष निर्विशेष ब्रह्म प्रतिपादक परस्परम भेद इति अभिप्रेत प्रमेय निरूपयति सो देर इज अ डिविजन देर एज टू जी अस्पष्ट ब्रह्मलिंग वाक्याज ऑल्सो बट सम आर डीलिंग विथ सगुण सम आर डीलिंग विथ निर्गुण बट स्टील ऐक्य मे नॉट बी वेरी क्लियर देर दोज आर डेल्ट विथ इन दि सेकेंड एंड थर्ड पाद रिस्पेक्टिवली देर देर इज समर्लैप देर देर फोर दे आर ग्रुप टूगेदर अस्पष्ट ब्रह्मलिंगा समन्वय प्रमेय इन दि सेकेंड एंड थर्ड पाद वॉट इज दईडिया दे अन्वया देर इज अस्पष्ट ब्रह्मलिंगा सो अस्पष्ट ब्रह्म लिंगम येशु मंत्रेशु वाक्येशु श्रुति वाक्येशु श्रुति मंत्रेशु ते अस्पष्ट ब्रह्म लिंगा और वाक्यानि इफ यू से देन अस्पष्ट ब्रह्म लिंग वाक्यानि मंत्रा इफ यू से देन पुल्लिंग अस्पष्ट ब्रह्म लिंगा 
Mantraha, Aspashta, Brahma, Lingani, Vakyani. Both ways it can be seen. And then, Tesham Samanvayaha, Aspashta, Brahma, Linganam. So, similarly, the Samasa construct is seen. Uh, similar in the first pada as to spashta brahma linga so spashta spashta brahma lingam yeshu mantreshu te spashta brahma lingaha mantraha this is how the samasa vigraha is and aspashta brahma linganam or spashta brahma linganam in the first pada samanvaya prameyam ityartha prameyam means vishaya so that samanvaya is the vishaya finally across all the four padas of the first chapter vedanta iti Vashya, uh, sorry, uh, Prabha, Ratna Prabha, Atha Adhikaranam Arachyate, Shrota Vyaha Iti Vihita Shramanatmatam Vedanta Mimamsa Shastram Vishayaha. Now, what is this first Adhikarana all about? This Adhikarana is being discussed here, Arachyate, how it has come about. Shrota Vyaha Iti Vihita Shramanatmatam Vedanta Mimamsa Shastram Vishayaha. So, the first part out of the five is Vishaya. What is the subject matter? Shrotavya, that is that mantra is the Vishaya there. So, Shrotavya iti. And it is a Vidhi. Therefore, Vihita Shravanatmakam. Kim Vidhiyate? Tasmin mantra Shrotavya iti. Mantra Kim Vidhiyate? Shravanam Vidhiyate. Therefore, Vihita Shravanatmakam Vedanta Mimamsa Shastram Vishaya. That Shastra. Shruti, where Shravana is the Vidhi, that is the subject matter of the first sutra, Athato Brahma Jidnyasa. Tatkim Arabdhavyam Navaiti, Vishay Prayojana Sambhava Asambhava Abhyam Samushaya. So we will come back to this, we will go to the Tika. So Tika says Vedanta iti Vedanta Vishayaka Poojita Vicharatmaka Shastra Mithyartaha. So, Mimamsa Shastram, what is the meaning of Mimamsa Shastram? The Shruti, there is Shrotavya iti Vihita Shravanatmakam Vedanta Mimamsa Shastram Vishya. That Shruti, which is a Vidhi, which gives a Shravana Vidhi, the Mimamsa of that is done in which Shastra? So, Vedanta Mimamsa Shastram is, means Vihita Shravanatmakam. Therefore, Vihita Shravanam. Shrotavya ityatra vihita shravanam atma swarupam yasmin mimamsa shastre vedanta mimamsa shastre tat vedanta mimamsa shastram vihita shravanatmakam shastram so what is that shastra that shastra is sutra sutra is the shastra which has the vihita shravana its swarupa it matches with the shrotavya vidhi and what is Mimamsa Shastra? What is the meaning of Mimamsa? Mimamsa means Pujita Vichara. Pujita Vichara is the meaning of Mimamsa. Therefore, Tika says Vedanta Vishayaka Pujita Vicharatmaka Shastra Mithyartaha. Vedanta, what is a Vedanta there? Shrotavya Vidhi. So, Vedanta Shrotavya Vidhi Vishayaka Pujita Vicharatmaka Shastra Mithyartaha. So, Swarupa of this uh, Sutra, which is Shastra, is Vichara, and that Vichara is what Pujita Vichara. So, that is Mimamsa. What is it? What is the Vishaya in it? The Vishaya is Vedanta. Which Vedanta? The Mantra Shrotavya. Thereby, there is Ekavakyata. Ekavakyata between the Shrotavya Mantra and Athato Brahma Jidnyasa. This is the idea there, the undercurrent of the Tika there. Vishayaha Uddesham iti arthaha. So, Kim Uddesha Sutra Marachate. So, there the idea is the Shrotavya Mantram Uddesha. Shrotavya is the mantra which is Shrotavya iti Mantram Uddesha. That is the Uddesha of the Vishaya means Uddesha there. Vishaya Prayojan iti. Further in the Ratna Prabha. Tatkim Arabdhavyam Nava Tatkim Shastram Tat Shastram Kim Arabdhavyam Nava Arabdhavyam Iti Vishay Prayojana Sambhava Asambhava Abhyam Samushayaha So the second part of the Adhikarana is 
Samushya, Vishaya is clear. What is the Samushya here? Samushya is Vishaya. Shanuk uh, the Shankar Shakara, Talavi Shakara, Vishaya. So what is the Vishaya? Vishaya means Samushya. What is the Samushya here? There has to be a doubt for an Adhikarana to be formed. The doubt here is whether this Shastra has to be begun or shouldn't be begun. Purva Pakshi says, no, it shouldn't be begun. Why? Vishaya Prayojanam is not there. Vishay prayojana abhava shastram na arabdhavyam iti puro pakshaha. Whereas the Siddhanti says no, the shastra should be begun. Why? Vishay prayojana sattvat. Vishay prayojana are, are there. How do you say so? Just by saying it wouldn't work, you have to prove that Vishay and prayojana are there. That has already been done enough. Now, in the Tika, what is said? Vishay prayojanas are there. This is what you say. Nanu Adhikari Sammanda Sambhava uh, Nanu Adhikari Sammanda Sambhava Asambhava Bhyam Api Adhikarana Prachyatam. You are saying that Vishaya Prayojanas are there. But in Anubandha Chatushtaya, Vishaya Prayojanas are not sufficient for the Shastra to be made, you know, to be formed or for, for any Shastra, there should be Anubandha Chatushtaya. Vishaya Prayojanas are only two. There is also Adhikari and what? There is Sambandha. So why do you say the Samshya is only about Vishaya and Prayojana? There is doubt even about Adhikari and Sambandha. Why not make that as a basis to create the Sutra? Why take only Vishaya and Prayojana? Why do you consider doubts regarding Vishaya and Prayojana only in the Anubandha Chatushtaya? Take the other two also and form it. Nanu Adhikari Sambandha Sambhava Sambhava Abhyam Api Adhikarana Vrachyatam. Please do it considering those also. Why not so? Why only Vishay Prayojana? Kim Vishay Prayojana Sambhava Sambhava Abhyam Eva? Chaturnam Prasakte Stulyatva Aditi Chen. All four are equal in Anubandha Chatushtaya. One is not superior to the other. One is not more important than the other. All four are equally important. Why not base it on the other two as well? If that is the doubt raised, no. Turtiya Chaturta Varnaka Yor Adhikari Sammanda Sambhava Sambhava Abhyam Adhikaranasya Nirupaniyatvat Nathra Prathama Varnake Tabhyam Adhikaranam Rachyate Currently, that is not important. Why? Because it is going to be taken up later in the different sections of the introductory text. Therefore, Adhikari and Sambandha are going to be dealt with. But whether the first sutra should be created, whether the Shastra should be created, sutra, Brahma Sutra, for that, initially these two are important. Why so? Which two? Vishaya and Prayojana. Why so? He says, Nacha, uh, yeah, so, uh, so he takes this objection again and refutes that. Nacha vinigamana viraha iti vachyam. And you should not say, he says, you should not say there is vinigamana viroda. Uh, what is a good English word for vinigamana? So vinigamana viroda is so the definite conclusion, you know, the ascertainment. Samshaya has to go only when the Mimamsa Pujita Vichara is conclusive. So Nacha Vinigamana Viraha Iti He says, if you start by analyzing only Vishaya and Prayojana, meaning the Puro Pakshi's view, if at all you take Vishaya and Prayojana, then there won't be definite conclusion. There will still be Samshaya pending in this Adhikarana. Why? Because you have not dealt with the other two. Nacha Vachyam. Siddhanti says, no, you should not object so. Why? You should not raise such an objection. Why? Prayojanasya Prathamam Akamshitatvena. Uh, uh, Prathamam Akamshitatvena Mukhyatvat 
तत्सिद्धे विषय सिद्धि अंतरा निरूपयतु अशक्यत्वाद विषय प्रयोजने पुरस्कृत अधिकरण रच्यते इति भाव हा इवन इन दी विषय इवन अमांग दी विषय एंड प्रयोजन बिटवीन विषय एंड प्रयोजन व्हाट इज इम्पोर्टेंट प्रयोजन इज इम्पोर्टेंट प्रयोजनम अनुदिश्य मंदोपी न प्रवर्तते न मंदोपी प्रवर्तते इवन अ मंदा बुद्धि वोंट हैव प्रवृत्ति इन एनीथिंग अनलेस देर इस प्रयोजन किमुता अन्य हा if a manda buddhi will also not take any efforts unless there is some prayojana, what to talk about others who have some buddhi, who have better than manda madhyama ityadi buddhi, madhyama, madhyama or tivra buddhi. Obviously everyone looks at what is the prayojana. And Shruti says, nishprayojanam karyam na kuriyat. One should not do any, Shastra says that, like Jalatada Nadi Vata. You should not, you know, children play, they do not know any better, so they play in water, they, you know, hit water and all that. But it is nishprayojana for one who has buddhi. There is waste of time. There is no entertainment value there. It is all nuisance value. Time passes by, which is important for moksha, because Manushya Janma is for moksha. So nishprayojana one should not do. Everything should have a prayojana and that percolates through and through in each and every activity even without knowing there is some prayojana backing. Therefore, between vishaya and prayojana also prayojana is important. Now, Nacha vinigamana virahaiti vachya. Why? Why should you not object so? Siddhanti says, prayojana sya prathamam akangshi tattvena mukhyatvat. Prayojana akangsha will be there for every activity to be undertaken. Therefore, prayojana is important and prayojana tat siddhe, prayojana siddhe, vishe siddhi mantara nirupayetu ashakyatvad. Although prayojana is important, without the subject matter you cannot establish it. They go hand in hand. They are tied together. If you tell someone prayojana, if someone, let's say someone wants a lot of money, just let's assume something, someone wants a lot of money. Most of us want a lot of money. How much money do you want a lot of wealth? How do you want it? There the question arises. Oh, I, I would like, you know, some comfortable means, dharmic means. So then vishaya becomes important there. If you tell someone, oh, I'll give you means, you'll make a lot of money, but these are not dharmic means. Who wants it? And considering... Dharmika people, of course, many won't care, but then, let's say something else, let's say, you know, you'll, you, uh, you become a, uh, you know, you become a, uh, something in that area, whatever is famous, you know, lack of particular set of doctors or something else. So you tell that person, this skill set is uh, lacking in this area, you take up that skill set, you'll like, make a lot of money. But he cannot take up that. Vishaya, once he knows then the idea itself, oh, I thought I would make money. Now, this Vishaya, once you have told me, you know, what should I be doing? I, I am incapable to do that. Oh, Adhikaritam is there. Everybody is an Adhikari. You can also take up. No. It, not everything is possible to, to be done by everyone. So, this person drops off. Prayojana and Vishaya will go hand in hand. Therefore, Vishaya Mantara, Vishaya Siddhi Mantara, without establishing Vishaya, Prayojana cannot be established. Therefore, Mukhyatvata pi Prayojanasya Mukhyatvata pi Prayojana Siddhe Vishay Siddhi Mantara Nirupaitu Ashakyatvata. You cannot establish it. Therefore, Vishay Prayojane Puraskritya Adhikarana Prachyateti Bhava. That is why these two have been taken, Vishay and Prayojana, to establish the Adhikarana, to, to form the Adhikarana. Brahmatmana Aikya Shunyau Viruddha Dharma Vattvad Viruddha Dharma Vattvad Dahana Tuhina Vat Iti Anuvanam Avipriyatya Puro Pakshayati So this Puro Paksha The Puro Paksha comes up with a with an objection This what is your Vishaya 
Without the Vishaya, you said you cannot establish Prayojana, although Prayojana is Mukhya. Now, what is the objection to Vishaya not being there and Prayojana not being there? Why? Because what has been said? There is Asambhava as per the Puro Pakshi. Vishaya is impossible. What is the Vishaya for the Siddhanti? Aikya. Brahmatma Aikya. So, Brahmatmana Aikya Shunyo means there is a uh, Sandhi which has taken place. So, Hoyavaya, then uh, Lopashakalisya. So, Bho Bhago Aga, Purvasi Yoshi, then Lopashakalisya, thereby Brahmatmana Aikya Shunyo. Brahmatmano had become Brahmatmana and then Brahmatmana Vakar Lopa Brahmatmana. So, what is this actually? Brahmatmano. Brahmatmano, Brahma and Atma are Aikya Shunyo. There cannot be, they are bereft of Aikya. You cannot have oneness between Brahma and Atma. This is a Puro Pakshi. Why? What is a Hetu? Viruddha Dharma Vatvad. Hetu is Viruddha Dharma Vatvam. So, Brahmatmano is the Paksha. Aikya Shunyo is the Sadhyam. What is the sadhana hetu viruddha dharma vattvam? What is the udharana de drishtanta? Dahana tuhani, uh, dahana tuhina vat. Dahana tuhinau. This is the uh, tuhina. If it is neuter, then dahana tuhina. So dahana tuhina are the, is the example. Dahana is, you can take both ways. Heat and tuhina is cold or fire and ice. Just like fire and ice are opposed to each other. Because of what? Because of heat and cold being their dharma. So, viruddha dharma vattvat. Since there is viruddha dharma vattvam in dahana agni and tuhina. Because vattvam is there, it is better to take agni. They have the meaning of agni also dahana. Dahana bhave yutpatti will give you heat. But then through other vitpatti you can get dahana as let's say fire agni and tuhina is ice so between fire and ice there is viruddha dharma they have one has heat the other has cold they are opposed to each other completely so viruddha dharma vattvat yatha drishtante tatha eva pakshe in paksha also brahmatma brahma and atma have viruddha dharma we know so many viruddha dharmas Brahma and Atma, Atma is Jeevatma, Alpa Shakti Maan, Brahma Sarva Shakti Maan Ishwara. Then Jagat Karanam Brahma and this fellow is Samsari Jeeva, Asamsari Ishwara. Jagat Karana and this person is thinking who created me, I was born, so I was created. So Jeeva there also Bheda, not only Bheda, Viruddha Dharmas. Then how do you claim? Ekata Aikya Shunyo Ananda Surupa Brahma. This fellow is a Dukhi Jeeva. Alpa Shakti Matum Alpa Jnanam also. Whereas the Ishra has which is Harma Sarvajna Sarva Shakti Man. Viruddha through and through. Therefore Aikya Shunyo. This is the Siddhant is Anumana. Iti Anumanam Abhipretya Puro Pakshati Atraiti. Vyakya Atra Naham Brahmaiti Bheda Grahi Pratyaksheda Kartrutva Kartrutva di Viruddha Dharmavatva Linga Kanumani in a cha Virodhena Brahmatmano Brahmatmano ho Aikyasya Vishyasya Sambhavat Satyavandasya Jnana Nurati Rupa Palasambhavat Naram Haniyam Shastram Iti Prapte. Siddhanta. So, Puro Pakshi's objection is what? Naham Brahma Veda Krai Pratyaksha is it? If you ask anyone, are you Brahma? Everyone knows. Jata Matra Pranidhyana is there. Dvaita is known to even a newborn. As soon as the child starts speaking, if you ask him, are you Brahma? He does not even know what Brahma is. If you explain who is the Brahma, who is this Brahma, five-year-old, eight-year-old kid, if you explain, 
who is this Ishwara? And then you ask him, are you Ishwara? He says, no. You ask someone who goes to Dvaita Patshala for 12-20 years, ask him, are you Brahma? Definitely no. He will get angered also. Why? Pratyaksha Pramana is there. Everyone knows that I am not Brahma. Pratyaksha. And Pratyaksha is Prabala Pramana on which everything is based. So Puro Pakshi says, Naham Brahma iti Bhedagrahi Pratyakshena. Pratyaksha Pramanena. The, and what is the Anumana for the Kartrutva Kartrutvaadi Viruddha Dharma Vattva Linga Kanumanena. Cha. Anumana has already been mentioned in the Tika. Kartrutva Bhok Jiva Jivatma. Atma has Kartrutva Bhoktrutva. Whereas Ishwara is Akarta. He has Akartrutva Abhoktrutva Brahma. Ityadi Viruddha Dharma Vattva. So these Lingas are there. Kartrutva Kartrutva are opposed to each other. And all the Dharmas that we saw are opposed between Brahma and Atma. Thereby Viruddha Kartrutva Kartrutva Adi Viruddha Dharma Vattva Linga Kanumani Nacha. Second also, you have Pratyaksha Virodha also. You have Bheda is known through Pratyaksha and it is confirmed through Anumana. Because Viruddha Dharma is there. Thereby Virodhena Brahmatmanoho Aikyasya Vishyasya Asambhava. This Vishya is Aikya Vishya for your Adhikarana. That itself is Asambhava. Between Brahma and Atma there cannot be Aikya because of Pratyaksha Virodha as well as Anumana Virodha. Iti Prapte. What should be done? Satya Vandasya. Now therefore what? Vishyasya Asambhava. Aikya Vishya is impossible. Your Vishya of Aikya between Brahma and Atma is impossible. Since it is impossible, Jiva who is samsari and the moksha that you are talking about is going to be through jnana. Moksha of what? Of bandha. The Jiva is bandha. Samsari meaning bandha. He has bandha. He has bandhana. That bandha is what now? It is satya. Satya bandhasya. Jnanat nivrutti rupa phala sambhavat. Phala sambhavat. This phala that you are talking about is what? It is jnanat mokshaha, jnanena moksha, jnanadeva kaivalyam. That kaivalya is aikya. That phala is impossible. Which is nivrutti rupa. Nivrutti is possible only when jnanat nivritti. Nivritti is possible by karma, upasana. There is jnana nivritti also, jnanat nivritti. Which is applicable in which case? If you look at sarpa, there is satya sarpa. If you have satya sarpa, if you have some jnana, oh, it is satya sarpa. It is not raju, there is raju next to it, but this other line next to it is Sarpa. That is Satya Sarpa. With Satya Raju being next to it or having Bhranti Jnana of Sarpa is Raju or by knowing Sarpa as Sarpa. Any of these Jnanas, will it get Bhaya Nivrutti? Will it give you Bhaya Nivrutti? It won't give you. What do you have to do? You have to do some karma. Either you have to, if you are in a forest area, you run away. If you are inside your house, you cannot run away. You have to do some karma to make the snake run away. Therefore, karma is needed. Or let's say, you know, there are some mantras, mantra shakti is there, whereby sarpa can be, you know, made to go away. So, some other way the mantras may be there. Some karma has to be done though. If you chant it, you invoke something, you invoke subramanya and then make the sarpa go away. You invoke Garuda and make him go away, whatever it is. Some karma, Vachika, Manasika, in case of Alaukika. In the case of Laukika, you may take a stick and scare it away, drive it away. There, karma is needed. Jnanat Nivrutti, Na Sambhavati. Whereas, if it is a fake snake, 
it is a Raju which appears like a Sarpa, Raju Sarpa. Then you invoke Garuda, you invoke Subramanya, you use any other Veda mantra, you use a stick also and hit it. Nothing can take away the bhaya unless the Jnanopatti takes place. As to this is not a Sarpa, it is Raju. It is a rope, not a snake. That is Jnana Deva Kaivalyam. Now, in this case, Jnana Deva Kaivalyam case, Yatha Satya Sarpasya Jnana Atnivriti Na Sambhavati Tatha Tatha, in this case, Satya Vandasya Jnana Atnivriti Rupa Phala Asambhavat. Your Phala is Nivriti Rupa. Nivriti, so Jnana can give you Nivriti of Ajnana. That's all it can do. In this case, Bandha is Satya. If Bandha is Satya, Jnana cannot give you Nivriti. You have to have something else, other means. Therefore, therefore, wherefore? Because Naham Brahma Bheda is known through Naham Brahma Pratyaksha Pramana. Kartrutva Akartrutva Dharmas are Viruddha. Therefore, Viruddha Dharma is the Anumana. And further, Satya Bandha cannot go by Jnana alone. And your Vishaya happens to be Aikya between Brahma and Atma. Through Jnana, you will have Nivritti Rupa Phala, which is Moksha, Dukkha Nivritti Ityadi, Sukha Prapti. All of these are not possible, therefore, Asambhava. Therefore, no Arambhaniyam Shastram iti prapte. When the Puro Pakshi says so, what is the Siddhanta? Siddhanta in the Tika. Naham Brahmi iti Pratyakshasya Ahamamshe Vishishta Vishayakatvena Vishishtatvena Rupena Atvana Brahmaikya Anangi Karena Pratyaksha Virodabhavad Ukta Anumanasya Ukta Anumanasya Satpratipakshatvadi Doshagrasatvad Bandasya Adhyasatvacha Vishay Prayana Siddhir Iti Siddhanta Sutram Patati Siddhanta Iti. So, what is the Siddhanta's response now? Naham Brahma that you are talking about with a Pratyaksha Pramana. What is the Pratyaksha Virodha there? Pratyaksha Pramana, there is no Virodha, there it is not an objection at all. Why? We do not disagree with you. Yes, Pratyaksha Naham Brahma is there. Where is it there? It is between the Vishishta. Not between the Shuddha Brahma and Shuddha Atma, meaning not between Chaitanya. In between Chaitanya and Chaitanya, there cannot be any Virodha, it is Ekaeva Chaitanyam. Ekameva Chaitanyam. So, Virodha that you talk about is that Bheda that you talk about, Naham Brahma, considering what, who is that Aham there? Is that Aham Shuddha Chaitanya Atma there when you talk about Naham Brahma? No, you introduce yourself as son of this person, daughter of this person, with playing this role. I have this kind of a job, this kind of a business. I am, I belong to this Varna, this Kshetra, all these ideas are there. That is all body. This is the one who is celebrating birthdays after birthdays. That kind of a person says, I am not Brahma. We agree, he is not Brahma. When did we say he is Brahma? We didn't say that is the Brahma. That is not the Vishay at all. We want to take away the idea of these birthdays and idea of these being associated with the Sharira, which has all sorts of Visheshanas. And then that Sharira itself becomes a Visheshana to Chaitanya, although it cannot be. That is Adhyastha. That is an Upadhi really. Because Atma is Asangi. Now, you are saying Naham Brahmiti Pratyakshasya Aham Amshe what Vishishta Vishayakatvena Vishishtatvena Rupena Atmanaha Brahmaikya Anangi Karena. We don't accept. We don't accept oneness between this Vishishta Brahma Ishwara who is Sarvashakti Man and this Alpa Shakti Man Ityadi Guna Vishishta Jiva Atma. We don't accept that Anangi Kara. In which case we accept that you are saying there is Bheda there. 
Yes, there is Veda there, but we do not accept Abheda at that level. Abheda is between Avishishta Chaitanya, who is also called as Brahma, who is also called as Atma. These are two different names for one singular entity, which is Satchidananda Atma. Satyam Jnanam Anantam Brahma Atma. Their Aikya is established by removal of Visheshanas, whereas Aikya is Satyam, because Aikya is not between two there. There is only one there. So Aikya is only when you talk about two and then land on it. There it is one alone. We are proving that there is one. So Aikya between Jiva and Brahma means that Visheshanas are to be taken away and there is Abheda, not that Vishishta has, Vishishta Brahma and Vishishta Atma have Abheda. <coughs> Therefore, Pratyaksha Pramana telling you that there is Abheda as impossible and Bheda as real, that is not an objection at all. <coughs> so, there is no Virodha at all. Vishishta having Bheda and Avishishta having Abheda, there is no Virodha between them. Therefore, Pratyaksha has been countered. Then, Anumana has been given. Pratyaksha Virodha Bhava. Pratyaksha Virodha is definitely not there. Now, Ukta Anumana Sikkim. What about that Ukta Anumana we have also given? Dharma Virodha or Virodha. That is also countered by saying that Dharmas are Virodha, but we are going to take away with Bhagatyaga Lakshana. But anyway, they will show you doshas because you are using Tarka, will show you doshas with Tarka itself. Therefore, Pratyaksha Virodha Bhavat Ukta Anumanasya Satpratipakshatvadi Dosha Grastatvat. Your Hetu is Hetva Bhasa, says the Siddhanti. It's a Hetva Bhasa, there it has Satpratipaksha Dosha, there are other doshas also. Satpratipaksha means it has an opposing Hetu, which is a Prabala Hetu, in fact. So, Prabala Hetu will counter the, which is opposed to the Hetu that the Puropakshi has given, that Hetu will counter it. Therefore, his Anumana will also be shown as flawed. Thereby, Bandhasya Adhyastatva. Therefore, what? Bandha is Adhyastha. Since Aikya is real as per the Shruti, and all the differences cannot disprove it because differences are at Visheshana levels and thereby Vishishta levels. Thereby Avishishta cannot have objection of having Abheda. So you don't have any Pratyaksha Virodha, you don't have any Anumana Virodha, your Anumana is clouded with Doshas. Therefore, what Siddhanti is saying is Shruti Sammata Aikya Vishaya is established. How so? Because the Bheda is Adhyastha. Because Visheshanas are Adhyastha, therefore Bheda is, is not Adhyastha. Bheda, idea of Bheda is Adhyastha as well. It is erroneous. It is erroneous conclusion. It is Ajnana. Bheda Grahana is with respect to the Visheshta Jiva where we say it is okay. But when you apply and extend it to Chaitanya, Chidrupa Brahma, Chidrupa Atma, there it is an error. Therefore, what should you conclude? Since the Aikya is the reality and Visheshanas are not part of Chaitanya, therefore they are Adhyastha. And if they are Adhyastha, then Adhyastha Tvacha, Bandhasya, Bandha is also Adhyastha. This person who holds on to, like a monkey holding on to a fruit in a small neck pot. The fist with the, the fist with the fruit is large for the neck so that it cannot pull out the hand. This is how monkeys are trapped it seems. We are like that, we are holding on to the Jeevatma holds on to the Sharira, calls himself a Samsari because he holds on to Samsara and while hugging the Samsara wants freedom, that won't happen ever. Thereby, first you superimpose, 
and then you say why oh, you start crying that won't work you have to take away the superimposition adhyasa has to be removed jnana will take this away so bandhasya adhyastatva cha vishaya prayojana siddhir the monkey would be free as soon as it knows that this phala has trapped me that is my bandha it lets it go and then easily can remove its hand similarly we can easily disentangle from the samsara easily is a easy is easily said than done so easier said than done that kind of an adesha you are a brahma you are free do not involve yourself with the sharira it's a fact but very difficult to process so vichara kartavya bandhasya adhyastatva cha vishaya prayojana siddhiriti सिद्धांत सूत्र पठति सिंस दि विषय के नॉट हैव एन ऑब्जेक्शन बीट प्रत्यक्ष अनुमान और योर बंध बीइंग इंपॉसिबल आल्सो के नॉट बी ऑब्जेक्टेड बिकॉज प्रयोजन इज व्हाट बंध विल गो बाय ज्ञान ऐक्य विल गिव यू मोक्ष बंध निवृत्ति दैट बंध निवृत्ति इज पॉसिबल थ्रू ज्ञान एंड ओनली थ्रू ज्ञान नॉट ओन नॉट थ्रू ज्ञान आल्सो ओनली थ्रू ज्ञान व्हाय because it is adhyastha so bandhasya adhyastatva cha vishaya prayojana vishaya why vishaya is established because of what reason because pratyaksha objection is invalid and the anumana objection is also invalid there is no virodha and prayojana is established because of what reason established in sense the siddhanti may still need to prove it but then possibility at least is there bandha can go by only jnana because of being adhyastha thereby sutram pathati siddhanta iti mula so ratna pravas is athato iti prapte iti prapte di asambhava is prapta as per the puro pakshi so siddhanti says sambhava siddhanta athato brahma jignasa iti the sutra is athato brahma jignasa we have seen atha means after gaining साधन चतुष्टय संपत्ति अतः देर फोर देर फोर मीन वॉट सिंस विषय एंड प्रयोजन आर देर देर फोर वॉट ब्रह्म जिज्ञासा टीका सत्प्रतिपक्ष अनुमान अनुपदम वक्ष्यते टेकिंग ईच ऑफ दीज दि सत्प्रतिपक्ष विल बी शोन इट विल बी शोन लेटर ननु अस्य सूत्र से कथम श्रोतव्य श्रुतिमूलक भिन्नाथकत्वादीत आह How do you say this is this Athato Brahma Jignasa Sutra has the same meaning as Shrotavya Shruti Mantra? Because Bhinna Artha Katwa Shrotavya is what Vidhi Vidhi Ling is there. Here what do you have? Here you don't have anything equivalent to Vidhi Ling. You have Athato Atha Athaha Brahma Jignasa Brahma Jignasa is a Samasa. So Brahmani Jignasa Brahma Jignasa Brahmana Jignasa Brahma Jignasa iti va. And what will you add? सिंपल अन्वय यू लैड भवती यू से भवती वर्तते अस्ति विद्यते हाउ इज दिस गोइंग टू हैव एक वाक्य तो श्रोतव्य वेर कर्तव्य तुम इज देयर श्रवणम कर्तव्यम इत्यर्थः श्रोतव्य इति मन्त्रस्य अत्र तु नास्ति एव सो इन द सूत्र हाउ कैन यू एक वाक्य तो इत्यतः रत्नप्रभा अत्र श्रवण विधि समानार्थत्वाय कर्तव्या इति पदम अध्यार्थव्यम सो रत्न प्रभाकार सेस यू हैव टू ऐड द वर्ड कर्तव्या फॉर द अनवय टू बी कंप्लीट यू डोंट ऐड भवति देयर कर्तव्या यू हैड देयर बाय यू विल गेट द एग्जैक्ट मीनिंग एज श्रोतव्य मंत्र सो अथा तो ब्रह्म जिज्ञासा कर्तव्या जिज्ञासा बीइंग स्त्रीलिंग यू से कर्तव्या अध्यार्थम च भाष्य कृता ब्रह्म जिज्ञासा कर्तव्या इति एंड भगवान भाष्य करा एज गंसो इन हिज वृत्ति In his bhasha, he has said that kartavya pada should be added there. Tika idam upalakshanam purusha pravrti siddhi anuvada pariharayuho. Now this is an upalakshana for purusha pravrti siddhi as well as anuvada parihara. It is a vidhi. It is not an anuvada. If you say from shruti, it can be known. Yes, it can be known through shruti, but then samshya is there. So it is not a mere anuvada. If you add kartavya, then you will know that mantra is not an anuvada, what you already know, and sutra is going to analyze that. 
purusha pravrutti siddhi it is a vidhi you will know and it will prod since it's a vidhi kartavya once you say it is like shravanam kartavyam then it will get the person who hears it to act on it so purusha pravrutti siddhi is also due to this kartavya pada being added kartavya pada added in sutra so the followers will be prodded to act on it tatha cha uh just an aside uh, there was a question uh, earlier i had uh, mentioned so this upalakshana i had given the example upalakshana upalakshana uh, in the tatastha lakshana there was an objection uh, as to upalaksh is it upalakshana the crow on devadatta's house that is a house where you see crow on devadatta's house so there that was explained as a tatastha lakshana so i looked up uh, i forgot to mention upalakshana is used in vada granthas upalakshana u is used because upa has the meaning of samipe upa samipe so samipa lakshana if you take that vritti if you take that kind of a vigraha upalakshana means samipa lakshana then it is same as tatastha lakshana in vada granthas upalakshana is also used for tatastha lakshana so tatastha lakshana and upalakshana are not different upalakshana is generally the example for upalakshana is what kake bhyo dadi rakshatam so there kakebhya and even in this case of the crow on devadatta's house which i had explained as the crow is an upalakshana the vakya is not an upalakshana but vakya can also be taken as upalakshana meaning what meaning tatastha lakshana only same it is a synonym it can it also has that meaning especially used uh, as far as i know in vada granthas meaning in brahat prasthana traya dvaita siddhi ityadi and this upalakshana here is you know it includes others also this is like kake bhyo dadi laksh dadi rakshatam so when you add kartavya what exactly you are doing so it has the same meaning as shravana vidhi it also has the other meanings of uh, it will extend to others also it will also help you get purusha pravrutti siddhi as well as anuvada parihara tatha cha vidhi samanarthatvaya anuvada pariharaya cha so this this answer was for jeevraj ji by the way so if jeevraj ji if you are there this upalakshana and uh, tatastha lakshana was for you your question so it has the same meaning as tatastha lakshana okay so idam upalakshana purusha pravrutti siddhi anuvada pariharayo tatha cha vidhi samanarthatvaya anuvada pariharaye cha for vidhi samanarthatvam it is not an anuvada it is it is vidhi shrotavya vidhi and athato brahma jignasa kartavya have the same meaning now it's a vidhi now and therefore it is not anu anuvada anuvada pariharaya cha and what else other benefit you get as shastre pra, purusha pravrutti siddhi therefore shastre purusha pravrutti siddhaye cha sutre kartavya iti padam adhyartavyam iti bhavah so you get three benefits by adding the word kartavya and thereby you form the sutra vritti kartavya <coughs> kartavya padadhyare shri भाष्यकार सम्मति आह एंड भगवान भाष्यकार एग्रीज विथ दिस इनफैक्ट दी टीकाकार फॉलोज दी भाष्य जी व्याख्यानकार फॉलोज दी भाष्य एंड ही सेज दैट भाष्य इट सेल्फ हैज दिस एज टू अध्यार्थम च भाष्य करता ब्रह्म जिज्ञास कर्तव्य है टीका फॉर द सेज मिश्र मतानुसारेण स्तु श्रुति सूत्रोर ऐक्य रूप निभाव विषय प्रयोजन ज्ञानादेव पुरुष प्रवृत्ति सिद्धि श्रवणे विद्य संभव कर्तव्य पदम इति वदन्ति सो यू टॉक अबाउट दीज थ्री थिंग्स पुरुष प्रवृत्ति सिद्धि विधि सामान्य मीनिंग एंड अनुवाद इट इज नॉट अनुवाद दिस कैन बी एस्टाब्लिश इन अदर वेज ऑल्सो देर फॉर मिश्र मतानुसारिणी मीनिंग वाचस्पति मिश्र अनुसारिणी अनुसारिण अनुसारिणी वन पर्सन अनुसारिण मेनी सो मेनी हू फॉलो दी भामती मत इच्छा दो जो फॉलो भामती मत वॉट डज भामती कार से ही से श्रुति सूत्र यो ऐक्य रूप निव यू डोंट नीड दैट कैंड ऑफ अर देर इज नो रूल दैट अथा तो ब्रह्म जिज्ञास शुड एक्जैक्टली मीन वॉट श्रोतव्य विधि मीन्स इट नीड नॉट हैव दैट कैंड ऑफ देर इज नो सच रूल Further, what does he say? Vishe prayojana jnana deva. Once you know vishe and prayojana, in athato brahma jidnyasa, there is vishe and prayojana. Tat jnana deva purusha pravrutti siddhi. So purusha pravrutti siddhi is possible. Why? Because jnana takes place. So vishe is there, prayojana is there. You don't need ekavakyata for that between shruti and sutra. 
श्रवणे विद्या संभवंच एंड इन श्रवणा यू कैनॉट हैव विधि यू बिकॉज श्रवणा इज वॉट विचारात्मक एंड वॉट इज दट विचारात्मक ज्ञान एंड इन इन युअर केस वॉट जिज्ञासा इज ज्ञातुम इच्छा इन ज्ञान यू कैनॉट हैव विधि एंड इन इच्छा ऑल्सो यू कैनॉट हैव विधि यू कैनॉट आस समन यू नो वाई डोंट यू डिजायर दिस he has no vasana for it she does not have any vasana why would she desire it even if trying you cannot desire the child does not want to eat the food the mother says you eat this vegetable the child does not want it no you desire it if the mother says you desire it gets a strict father in and says oh you desire it how can you not desire a vegetable you should desire it you will desire it even the child cannot desire no one can desire by force you cannot ask someone to desire there cannot be vidhi in ichha How about Nyana? Oh, know this. Why don't you know this vegetable as sweet and eat it? You like sweet. You have a sweet tooth. Why don't you know this as sweet and eat it? He cannot know it. Why he cannot can see vegetable? Pratyeksha pramana is there. You cannot have Nyana vidhi there. It is not kartru tantra. It is vastu tantra. Based on vegetable, he'll see vegetable. He'll taste vegetable. You cannot ask him. Oh, have Nyana? Have you know? Have cognition of sweet there? He cannot cognize sweet at all. So jnana and ichha both cannot have vidhi. You cannot say kartavya, jnanam kartavyam, ichha kartavya. Both ways, anvaya is not possible. Why would you add kartavyam there? Kartavya. This is the bhamati uh, mata. So they say shravana vidya sambhavancha manvana. They consider that in shravana there cannot be vidhi. Therefore kartavya padam na adhyarto miti vadanti. They say kartavya word should not be added. So he goes against the bhasha and says no, it should not be added. Then what is the what is his view? Tanmati he sadhana chatushte sampatyanantaram Brahma jidnya se ichha bhavati bhavati eva. So he says that once you have sadhana chatushte sampatti, then once you know vishen prayojana, there will be pravrutti. You want to do jidnya sa. So bhavati not kartavya bhavati. There will be so you do a simple anvya add bhavati. Thereby he says, kartavya should not be added. It will make no sense. There will automatically be pravrutti. This is the paksha of bhamati. Karma phalasya nityatvad brahma jnana parama purushartha shravana cha iti shrota shrauto artha. So what is the shrutra artha for them? The shrutra meaning is brahma jnana bhavati after atha ataha. Atha means after sadhana chatushtya sampatti being gathered by this person, he becomes an adhikari. And ataha since anubandha chatushtya vishya prayojana is there, this fellow is an adhikari now. Sammanda is there. Then what Brahma jidnyasa bhavati? Thereby you don't need anything else. What else is the reason? Is it karma phalasya anicchatva? This person knows parikshalokan. There vidhi sutra there is parikshalokan. Brahmano nirveda maya. Then तद्विज्ञानार्थम स गुरुमे वेत समीपाणी श्रोत्र ब्रह्मनिष्ठ सो वन शुड गो टू दि गुरु इज दि विधिवाक्य फॉर वाचस्पति मिश्र सो भामती टेक्स दिस एज परीक्ष लोकान कर्म फल से अनित्यत्व न्याय से परीक्ष लोकान मंत्र टेल्स यू दैट लोका इज अनुभव सो हैविंग एनलाइज कर्म फला वन नोज अनिच्छत्वम इन कर्म फल देर बाय ब्राह्मण निर्वेद माया देर बी वैराग्य एंड देन साधन चतुष्टे संपत्ति विल बी अटेन्ड बाय ड्यू टू वैराग्य प्रॉडिंग विवेक इज देर वैराग्य इज देर देन हिल डेवलप शमादि षटकम एंड मुमुक्षा विल कम अबाउट देन ब्रह्म जिज्ञास भवती फर्दर वॉट ब्रह्म ज्ञान परम पुरुषार्थ श्रवणाच्चि एंड ही हेज हर्ड ज्ञान वै कैवल्यम सो इन श्रुति मंत्र आर देर ही इज अ वैदिका नित्य श्रवण विधि इज देर बिकॉज ऑफ दि विधि ड्यूरिंग ब्रह्मचर्य इट्स ही हेज हर्ड हिज पेरेंट्स टोल्ड हिम हिज गुरु टोल्ड हिम एंड देन दे सैड वॉट यू शुड गेट उपनयन एंड डू नित्य कर्म यू शुड चैंड दि वेदा स्वशाखा अध्ययन स्वाध्याय अध्येतव्य ही नोज दैट एंड देन In the shaka, he has heard these mantras about what Brahma Jnana Parama Purusharta Shravana is done. So 
ब्रह्मज्ञान परम पुरुषार्थ दिस मच ही हेज हर्ड देर फोर देर विल बी प्रवृत्ति हाउ विल देर बी नो प्रवृत्ति दिस इज देर मीनिंग ज्ञान से विचार साध्यत्व विचार कर्तव्यता आर्थिक आय वही थी फाइनली वॉट इज देर कंक्लूजन दे से दैट ज्ञान इज गोइंग टू बी देर ओनली वेन इट इज नॉट भ्रम इट हेज टू बी प्रमाण सो इट शुड बी प्रमात्मक ज्ञान हाउ विल दैट टेक प्लेस थ्रू विचार so it is very obvious he says these obvious things you do not need to add this anyone knows say some has some buddhi they know jnanasya vichara sadhyatva jnana will come about only in vichara led by something but then vichara should be there only then jnana takes place otherwise one can give exams by learning by rote but if jnana has not taken place if vichara has not been done then jnana will not take place that person does not have jnana he can just you know like a like a recorder he can parrot it like a parrot he can parrot it like a recorder he can you know just repeat it play it out but then he does not understand that's why in language skills also you know you have these can you write can you read can you understand read and write is okay you can read and write letters anybody who knows marathi hindi some other languages they can read letters and transliteration in english also is possible of sanskritam just because one can read devanagari does not mean one understand sanskritam by any language true for any language so read write and understand also can you speak other thing so understand is there jnana is understanding that is vicharatmaka it is vichara janya so vichara sadhyatva jnanasya vichara kartavyata arthika evo it is an implied meaning there it need not be made literal there अत्र विचार अनारंभवादीन हा हवे बर दीज आर ऑल सिद्धांत इन सिद्धांत देर इज अ डिविजन ऑफ सेक्ट फाइनली आई के नॉट कॉम्प्रोमाइज वॉट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ सूत्र एज टू वॉट आर दी हाउ डू एस्टैब्लिश दी सूत्र दीज मेकैनिजम मे बी डिफरेंट सो दे आंसर देर ओन द्वैत ओपोन डिफरेंटली बिट्वीन अद्वैत इन देर इज सम डिस्कशन देर इज सम हेयर स्प्लिटिंग आर्ग्युमेंट but i k is not compromised therefore what about the purva paksha there real purva paksha real purva paksha is saying atra who is dvaitin atra vichar anarambha adin ha what do they say upaya antara sadhya mukti riti phalam iti jnayam in phala there is bheda they say mukti cannot be attained through jnana it is through other means ratna prava ध्यात्मेंट यम ही कारुणिक शरण गई सहोदरापमहत्पदमु ह्रीं परमाश्रेय जनक जांगमुनंद सुखाकृति क्वेश्चन